Tunku Nur Kistina Petri Tunku Muhammad Rizam showed a great interest in a subject that is close to her heart at a forum on the late Tunku Abdurrahman Putra's political and intellectual legacies. She asked questions, she listened attentively. She jotted down notes at the forum which was part of the launch of the Tunku Abdurrahman Putra al Haj Cambridge Scholarship on Saturday. She is Tunku Abdurrahman's granddaughter and she has always wanted to know more about the former Prime Minister whom she has never met yet has played a big role in her life. I came about two years after he died and his death in itself was a huge impact for my father, um, his to-be son-in-law, my mother, who was ever so closely um, with him. She was, she was studying law um, because of him and she was brought back on the 5th of December because he said, no, you cannot come back on the 6th of December because you'll be coming back to my body. And true enough, on the 6th of December, he passed on. But um, getting back to it, it's just that despite being his granddaughter, I feel like I never knew the man that was my grandfather. She gets to know about her grandfather through her father and her grandfather's friends, letters from her grandfather to her mother, Tunku Nur Hayati, and forums like this. Historian Professor Hans van der Ven told the participants about Tunku Abraman's love for cars, sports and food during his days in Cambridge University's St. Catherine's College, which Christina finds it interesting. He therefore taught the cooks, the staff, how to cook uh, curry. <laughs> Apart from what I already knew, I thought it was a very good insight, like the curry part. I thought it was very amusing um, and it kind of really humanised him. Um, and I think that shows how much St. Catherine's actually appreciates him and his presence there. Yeah, exactly. Can you cook curry when you were 16? <laughs> the forum panellists and guests at the event spoke at length about her grandfather's spirit and values such as liberalism, pluralism and pragmatism that he stood for. It's come to a time where we know what was right and in hindsight, we know what we need to learn from the past. So I guess I'm doing my part in trying to learn of the past as a citizen of Malaysia. Tengku Nur Kistina's grandmother is Bibi Chong, whom Tunku Abdurrahman Putra married in July 1963. The 23-year-old graduated with a law degree from the University of Manchester and she is keen on pursuing her study in economics or political sociology.